though Ottawa is the capital of Canada, Quebec City is a very popular place, even when it's this cold. And most of the people in Quebec have French ancestry, don't they? Anyhow, the chief said this is where Carmen Sandiego's transmission came from. Let's get moving to stay warm. And keep our eyes peeled for clues as to where that Moko Gong has been stashed. That's an interesting wolf statue over there. We should go check it out. Ah, okay. I finally got this part to work. Yeah. Alright, um, so... I had to skip through the cutscene between the missions because I was afraid it would freeze up again. So, yeah. But basically, uh, Hawkins talks about how his family visits the can can Canada. All right, let's stay focused. Canada's flag features a leaf from its most famous tree, the maple. Yep. Maple syrup is popular here. Thick stone walls, steep copper roofs, axe-hewn beams. Man, they knew how to build houses back then. Yeah, Quebec contains some of the continent's oldest buildings. In fact, the oldest street in Canada is in Lower Quebec. Neat. Le Chateau Frontenac. It's one of Quebec City's most famous landmarks. Yep, named for the first French governor of the city. It was built in 1893 by the Canadian Pacific Railway. My parents used to love staying there. I seem to remember that Carmen hung out there too. Ooh, what's this? The envelope's empty, but what do you suppose this word means? Didn't I read in your Acme profile that you're a linguistics expert? We all have our strengths, Hawkins. And I do try to pick up some language in my travels. Something tells me that's a Zulu word. I'll note it in my journal. But checking your database might help us find out where it's from. Yeah. I have some familiarity with some languages, too. I guess you could say it's from this game and other games. Similar to this one. <laughs> oh, my childhood. Oh, yes, I remember. Carmen always used to talk about her concerns for the environment. Well, she's not very concerned about us, that's for sure. The environment? Okay, okay. Now, where have I heard that one before? <laughs> okay. <clears throat> what is this? It sure is a strange note. It makes me think it's got something to do with Carmen, though. It's so near her plaque on the wolf statue. Good thinking, Jules. Let's hang on to it. Maybe it'll help us track down that fish gong. Oh my, this is mysterious. <laughs> Excuse me. This phone is out of order. Maybe it'll be fixed later. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Uh... Eighty percent of the people in Quebec have French ancestry. So, I guess that means I better check the translator in my database and brush up on my French. But, you know, Canadians speak English, too. Sometimes they don't learn. Don't bother to learn it in school. Vast natural resources, like forestry, minerals, oil, and gas, keep Canada's economy going. Vast quantities of coffee would keep me going right now. I'm still getting used to the time change. Did you know Quebec City is the only fortified city north of Mexico? As a matter of fact, I... Wait a minute. I hear a car coming. Uh-oh. Hello. What the... Well, hello, you two. Looks like my trail isn't the only thing that's gone cold. Don't you just love Quebec in the winter? You may as well give up, Acme Agents, because you won't catch me. See you around. What? Hey! Come back! Oh boy. Hey, that was... that that was... Chief! We need a Type 44F radar track on a speeding vehicle in the lower part of Quebec City! It's Carmen San Diego. There's nothing on our tracking skill, Hawkins. Are you sure it was her? Sure I'm sure! She's given us the slip again. Ugh... But I bet it won't be the last we see of Carmen. We need to keep on the trail of these stolen artifacts. I have a hunch that they'll lead us right to her. Oh boy. That was scary. <laughs> hmm. Something tells me this will be important later. Alright, uh, what to do? Well, uh... Global transportation system for tra 
Well, if I type in, uh, no. No luck. Maybe we should check the spelling. Didn't I see that word written down somewhere? All right, let me see. Well, actually, I know the answer anyway. So what we're gonna do. Um. So Nonyama is a Zulu word, right? Let's see. This is so weird. Did you know that South Africa has three capitals? Their system of government was set up by the British. But why three? Isn't one enough? Well, Cape Town is legislative, where they make laws. Pretoria is the administrative capital. And Bloemfontein is the judicial. You know, for their courts. Cape Town is unbelievable. I thought you'd like it here. That flat mountain over there must be Table Mountain, right? Yeah. For hundreds of years, it's been a landmark for sailors rounding the southern coast of Africa. The waterfront looks like a good place to sniff out some clues. The sort of place Carmen San Diego might hang out. Oh boy. Hmm. Interesting. Look, it's the word from the envelope we found. Ngongyama means lion. Maybe that envelope was meant for here. It probably was. Let's check it out. Whoa. Look, at the top of the carousel, that symbol again. Carmen loves these kinds of puzzles. This has got to be something we need to complete, but I don't think we have all the pieces yet. Wow. You gotta love puzzles like these in these games. They're really interesting to solve. Yeah, interesting. We're gonna have to find the rest of the pieces. Kruger National Park is a world famous game reserve. I'd love to see it. Carmen was always talking about it. What else does she talk about? Look, a lecture on Shaka. He was king of the Zulus during the early 1800s, revolutionizing warfare in South Africa with his ideas on encircling the enemy. Wish he was still around. He could give us a few tips on how to encircle Carmen. <laughs> Don't let me hold you back. That's the world's largest gold field covering about 1,000 square miles. Incredible. I've heard the largest gold nugget was found there too. Oh my god. Look at this. And look above the door. You see what I see? He'll call you at the phone booth near the Chateau Fontenac. 7 o'clock p.m. Be there. That's Carmen San Diego. I know it. We gotta break the door down. No. Hold on, Hawkins. You have no idea what you might be walking into. It might be a trap. Write down the message. But don't touch that door. We may hear something else important. Well, at least let's try to intercept that call. Chief, we'll be needing an Acme XM1 tracking device. Good thinking, Hawkins. The Acme headquarters in Cape Town can give you what you need. Head for the electronics store on the waterfront. Will do, Chief. We're... Wait a minute. What's that? It's that chopper again. It's Carmen! What did I tell you? Chief, we spotted her again! Chopper heading north from Cape Town waterfront. Roger that, Hawkins. We'll try and follow her on our scopes. Man, one of these days... What were you thinking, Jules? Did you want her to get away? Well, maybe it's just as well she did. I'm counting on her leading us to something a lot bigger than we can imagine. She's just playing games with us. I can't wait to see her safely behind bars. Unfortunately, Hawkins, it may not be any time soon. Her helicopter mysteriously disappeared from our radar somewhere north of Table Mountain. Keep following her trail. Finding that Moko Gong is critical to figuring out what Carmen San Diego is really up. Maybe this message can help. Put it in your clue storage. I'm making a note of it in my journal. <sighs> Man. Now that was something. <laughs> and also kind of creepy, too. <laughs> yeah. The Victoria and Alfred waterfront here is a really popular destination for tourists and Cape Tonians alike. It has tons of shops and restaurants. Just the sort of place for a vile agent to disappear into the crowd. Nelson Mandela gave his historic address the day before he was inaugurated as South Africa's first black president in 1994, right here at the Cape Town City Hall. 
Ah, oh, God rest his soul. Yep. I don't know why I'm mentioning a higher deity right now, but, you know. <laughs> According to my briefing, this is a secret Acme field office. Ooh. The Acme XM1 call tracking device. No successful agent should ever be without one. I'll make room for this in my vest for sure. Oh, boy. Okay, let's, uh... I'm not sure. Evidently, Table Mountain was a landmark throughout history for ships traveling around the Cape from the Atlantic to the Indian Oceans. Neat. Okay, we're gonna go back to that phone booth. Big place. Canada. Huge. Second biggest country in the world. The northern part of Canada is sparsely populated, but there are still many native peoples living there, like the Inuits. That gong must be a key to figuring out Carmen's master plan. Carmen's trail is getting colder by the minute. And I'm getting colder too. What about you? Thanks for your concern, but this time I'm prepared. Perhaps you've heard of Acme standard issue heated long johns? Oh, uh, Okay. <laughs> I think he means insulated pants. Not in here. Uh... Agent Shadow Hawkins checking in. 6.59 p.m. and 41 seconds. Right on time. Ugh. Special Acme tracking device XM1 is ready. Now, why doesn't that phone ring? Patience, partner. Just be sure to activate your device when it does ring. Oh boy. Here we go. Okay. Tracking device on. Vial X77 Code 33B. The Golden Lion will not walk. Instead, it will sail in tonight. What? A code message? I got it down. But what does it mean? It obviously must have been meant for some vial agent. Could sailing in mean a boat? But which harbor would it be sailing into? Well, the tracking device indicates that the call was placed from the banks of the Seine River. The database will help in locating the spot to travel to. The banks of the Seine? I've been there. It's where the painters and booksellers hang out. Let's get out of here before one of Carmen's henchmen shows up. Oh, nice. <laughs> the Seine River. That's in France, right? Yeah, I've been playing this game too much. <laughs> All right, let's go. Have you ever been to Paris before? Uh, no. I always wanted to, though. What about you? Carmen introduced me to the city when I was a rookie. France is the biggest country in Western Europe. And you know what's amazing? 16% of the people of France live in Paris. Neat. It's going to load, um, eventually. Wow, so this is Paris. I can't believe that I've never visited the capital of France before. Yeah, well the locals pronounce it Paris. Carmen's conducted a lot of criminal activity here in the past. We need to be careful. Okay, Mademoiselle Carmen San Diego. If you're here, we'll track you down. Oh boy. He's already making on finding her again. Ha! <laughs> Bonjour. Yeah. Okay. Need to let it the load. Eiffel Tower was the world's tallest structure when it was constructed for the 1889 Universal Exposition. 984 feet tall, and still the most famous landmark in Paris. There's a picture of Carmen and me nabbing a criminal in front of it that's hanging in the Acme office here in Paris. Neat. Hey, who's that? Uh-oh. 
He's getting away. Stop him. Let's go after him. He's guilty of something. How many fish you have? Hold on, Hawkins. You have perfected the art of jumping to conclusions. Chief, does Agni have any other agents in the area? We've got a suspect on the left bank of the Seine across from the Notre Dame Cathedral. We've got two agents nearby. I'll notify them immediately. Any idea as to who it may be? Not sure. He left a painting that we're going to check out. It may be a clue in finding that gong. A painting? So what? Let's get after that thief. Don't you see something familiar about it? There's that wheel design again. This painting doesn't look like a city in France. Where is this place? Hey, Jules, don't get discouraged. That's where what you call my toys come in handy. Clue analyzer ready. Wow. <laughs> it's a street in Jerusalem. Not bad for a toy, is it? Pretty impressive, rookie. Nice. Whoa, this is interesting. This is really interesting. I didn't know Carmen had donated money to the Sorbonne, one of Europe's most important universities. She always was interested in ancient civilizations. I'm going to note this in my journal. The Sorbonne, huh? And the Carmen San Diego Foundation? Who knew she found her own uh, charity organization? Every time I see this design, there's some link to Carmen San Diego. Yeah, I'm starting to think you're right about that. What does this thing say? Hmm, a receipt. Something to do with a book. And La Dame Rouge. The Red Lady? Oh, we've got to find the shop this book came from. The Bon Livre. I believe that means the good book. And 25 francs. I'm pretty sure they used um, euros by now. Yeah, because of the European Union and all the, all the like. We're looking for a book. La Dame Rouge. Do you have it? La Dame Rouge, you say? The Red Lady. Yes, yes, I have that book. I was to hold it until someone requested it by name. I have not even opened it. Here, take it. Cool. It's been hollowed out, and look, another animal. What do you think? I don't know. But with a title like La Dame Rouge, I have to think Carmen's involved somehow. Yeah, we'll keep this for sure. Nice. We got another puzzle. <coughs> puzzle piece. All right.